Hello, quick video. Just doing a bit of line pointing here on a church in Weatherby. And I just want to show you, take this opportunity to show you how I was taught by an old stonemason pointing. Now, he told me, and he was 80 at the time, he's probably about 120 now, to get myself a stick. But a stick with a bit of a dog leg in it. And what you do is you take the bark off one side and you can hold it with your thumb and when it's at the right pressure, right time, and you can do it straight away really, whenever you want, you just press it in like that and it's these, and it's these tight joints, press it in with your stick that costs you nothing and he, he told me that's how the old boys did it years ago he also told me that lime mortar doesn't like steel so much and you can manipulate it, work it, press hard on it taking the bark off this seems to be like the most important thing you can work it in and when he's put that in then that's a bit soft and then you can work that round or if you've got a little bit of a wider joint you can get yourself a bit of stick like that. I think this is a bit of a roof pattern, but as you can see, I've been using it. And you're just pressing it back. I think some of the NHL guys sort of use, I've seen them on videos with corks, which is probably just the same as this. And I'm a step up from the old stick. And you press it in, work it round. And then you need to get a bit of a brush. Let me show you. I'm not going to show you too much of this. No brush. Now what a lot of people get a churn brush and they start whacking it back. Well that's just nonsense. All that you're doing is just brushing those bits off. Brushing any loose off maybe them bits there a lot and brush them off or brush them in trying to hit through the screen there's no need for all that banging because your stick's pressed it in hopefully you've pressed it in enough when you were actually pointing and you don't have to go back as deep as you think as long as you're onto lime you don't all this two times the joint and all that sort of stuff as long as you've actually gone back to lime, that's going to do you. You can see them bits there, just brush them off. And then here's some I did earlier. Well, in fact, two days ago, it's Monday today. And that's what you're looking for. No cracks, no blemishes. That's not, that's not a crack there, that's just a shadow in it. And that is going to weatherproof the stone to a degree it's not foolproof because normally you'd do a wider a wider point like that and make absolutely sure and make, well, this is what they're after with this finish so all as you need is your stick with the bark off can't show you I can't hold the video camera and put it in but you can actually put it on with that as well so you can get your mortar and put it on with that as well you see bend it round bit of stick, goes nothing thank you